match get I off. think so. Boom, have four people on A short. It's going to be a complete bloodbath here as they line up One for Asterisk. Remaining. He finds four with the ghost. There's another player coming in behind him. Zhang Hai will kill him. And just 20 seconds, 15 seconds into the round, it's a 1v1. Immediately, Eeyore here can not be caught asleep right now. Zhang Hai going to get the rest of your team executes over towards a and you can see Tom are keeping their options open and so very nicely done here for the meantime wasting that time 30 seconds left on the clock down one should be able to get the plant if they kill this guy on triple but Frostmine's gonna say screw inside hookah but will it be enough for him to open up the side with three defenders waiting asterisk will get that kill it's Asterisk that's using the Operator too, of all things, Texture somehow finds two, bursting out onto the site. It seems like it should have been doomed for Dom1, not possible to get the spike on the ground, but they will make it happen. Clip Shooter takes out Texture. Site is a 3v1 Spectre in hand, not the best weapon you want in this situation, but he can make it happen knowing this man, he finds a one. Now he needs one more to isolate oh. this fight, and he brings it to a 1v1, a double kill now for Zhang He. He's gonna say hi, hello, but Asterisk will finally end the boom. But boom, still got some weapons to work with here, Operator, as you said, here on Asterisk. So this is definitely doable for them as it was saved. Intro, though, making that entrance into the B site and texture will follow up. 5v3 already in front texture very low but lucky for them secret is on that sky the reason the timing and the next round boom, should have a little bit better knives out but oh no, no eeyore <laughs> can't make it happen face to fall back safely and now the hookah position is under contestion but flip driver finding one quickly done asterisk gets the trade immediately it's a 4v3 here 4v2 and they've made this thrifty eco round work yeah don't doubt don't doubt and the operator done. in the hand any of these options. Obscuring vision. So they have to go for a very, very safe plant. That means you can't play offsite. You have to stand your ground and win it out here. It is planted towards long, so they could potentially fall back to that, but Eugene has a different idea. He wants to go on the aggression here. He I wants to take that initiative. He could potentially find a double kill as they line up. Woo! One, two, give him the 4K. Three over boom. Yeah, Asterisk holds on to the drum. To be fair. We have kind of seen on the Apex side that lots of teams and what is that peak coming from Texture? Blaze King just wins <laughs> that out and I don't know what he was doing while peeking that. I guess he was trying to punish uh, Blaze who was being hampered by the fight. Hunter's Fury, but Frostmine will find another kill on John High. John He, maybe. Hi. Second one for him. This is oh, is it high? It's a pit of his own. So you can just do a, a, a wall right there, an ult. Rather, now you can't once you get operated. But I thought that was going to be the oh. play. Asterisk. You asked how much of value he was going to get. He's going to get all of it. Two kills, maybe a third. Oh, but Texture has something to say about it. A double kill for him. The knife's just slicing up the site here. And John High will get that kill on a Frostmine. Suddenly turned around. Ultimate has been taken down. That pit is no longer there. And Eeyore's gonna have to find some way. Almost landing a shot on John High. Too close for comfort to give him a haircut. Eeyore on the push. Will drop his lockdown to try and give him some space. But he's gotta wait a few seconds before he can really capitalize off of that. Blaze King here. Trying to entry into the Lamp's position. He knows that he has to be close. And he wins that fight. Texture though brings it down to a 1v2 after the triple kill for him pushed off of it They know that there's one towards showers and one has to be short as Texture did fall back flash out Blaze got in the open gonna be in the pocket But will he be able to pull this out of his sleeve blazing on the peak? He brings it down to a 1v1 He now knows where the last player is and on the road date. It's done. It's a sealed deal They know there's no that was a huge moment here for Texture to pull that play out Asterisk though trying to double dip here with this operator he gets the opening shot but as he's on the Asterisk cannot back off safely although that smoke will help him and perfectly falls back here will eventually get found by intro flip jitter could not help because of that great smoke and intro once again making the entrance onto the site frostmine will get that kill and now jong hai trading him out it's a 3v2 here ender on the post plant as a retake could potentially come out it seems to be for boom all right here eorn blaze Last two remaining for Boom. There's a lot of ground they have to cover. Jung Hai is playing all the way back towards a short as well for the post plant. Two players posted up in U-Haul, but they use both flashes trying to scout out some information. I don't think they're going to expect anyone here this quickly. Blaze has to find the kill, but there's two people to come on through in this one. Gets the first. That is absolutely huge. And he sees the shoulder, but it's not enough to find the kill on to Texture. Now it's Eeyore in a 1v2. Knows there's players on both sides. To your point here, when they're holding these really tight corners, that noob tube on raise could be influential and huge. He's able to get that one kill on a frost mine, and that's the Viper trading out the opposing one. Intro here inside the lamps will not see the light. Well, actually, he will, because Eeyore will send him back up 
into the depths. Now, Eeyore holding down that position. They know he's on the back of the side. Will, will he be able to find one more? No, Secret finding him from the back, and now they have taken control of the site. Boom here. They still have an opportunity to try and retake this. They got two ultimates up. They got those Seekers, and here comes the Showstopper. Opportunity, but can't connect on any of those shots. Boom are going to have to call this one off. Yeah, at this point, you know, tell them I can't pay rent anymore. I got to bail out of here. Asterisk somehow finds this up close and personal going out through the vents. And Zhang Hai, he wants that kill. And he, okay, no, he escapes. Not for long. Asterisk, what are you doing? He lands the hard shot, the easy shots, but misses those ones. He does get the third at the end. Okay. Great for them. Why is Asterisk is playing with this operator? Has a player there to destroy the dog on the push. It's good coordinated play from Boom. What you need when you don't have a dash, <laughs> but nothing too influential as of the meantime. Walls here by both Vipers on for boom. Otherwise, if this is another one that they lose and let that slip out of their hands like the 4v2 a while ago, then I'm not too sure. They might just be mentally boomed after it, but Frostman gets that kill. It should be a done round ender. Yeah, not the easiest one right there. Jung Hai going to get one before he's taken. Five left. The rotate to come in on here. That Viper's bit will be dropped towards a short, so nothing more. No great wall to hold him back off. Now Eeyore playing a very committed position here. Frostmine is going to get taken down, not lying a shot on a secret. No more hidden there. Eeyore will get that kill. Now on the push, Dexter will get that very roughly as Blaze came finding a double. One Molotov for intro to play with. He uses it. Actually, yeah. It's going to be down now. Astros getting sucked too, down to one HP. I mean, it's just miserable Easy. to play inside the smoke here, and he has no time. Yeah. And to start out with a play, we're going to see a lot with a team with Rays on Vine. The lineup of the Roomba, and there's just a Molly right there. Oh Look at intro me. absolutely ripping them apart, and he wants a little bit more. Those fangs striking, one, two, three. Can he find a fourth? He now knows where Frostmind is. He gets the 4K, looking for the ace, but... Okay. They got that trailblazer out. The dog looking for information somehow. So far, Spark has been quiet. Eeyore able to get that kill on Zhang Hai and Flip Jitter opening up the site here right now. This is looking pretty good for the side to boom, and it exploded on the site. Eugene going to tell Eeyore that that is going to be mine. And we're ready for it. Damwon taking more risks. Three players all the way up be long right here. Flip Jitter is good for two before he falls. It'll be a 3v3 for the rest of this round. And, well, Boomer still spread out very thin. Eeyore has to know he's really close nice. here. Intro immediately here to try and hold down the line to get that plant safely. But see on the move here, otherwise he will get flanked. And that should be a kill towards Asterisk. But no, he's giving his position away. Secret trap between a rock and a hard place. Able to find one. Okay, with the Guardian, keeping oh. him safe. He finds a double kill right now. And suddenly, the tables have been turned. It's all on a frostbind. 1v2, but he cannot make it happen as Damwon get a miracle. Or if they just shoot you better and Secret did just that. Gets one kill in front of him. Swings around. Takes care of the flanker as well. With just a Guardian in hand. Dom. This could be huge for them. Whoever gets that opening pick could potentially swing this entire round away and secret finds that one texture it's a complete bloodbath a flurry of frags and it goes fully in the way of that one this is match point and this should be the map sealed and dealt in that's any early peaks or anything like this over to the opposition just a smoke at the bottom of mid as Chexter continues to jump peak takes some information of what's happening down here. Secret has first contact here and a really good timing with the doggy here. Catches the information of two players at the very least. And he wants to flash out of this and play pretty aggressively off that too. But he just gets shot oh. straight through the smoke. Okay, asterisk on fire in the pistol rounds. This dude has got x-ray vision. Somehow getting that kill texture will get one at least for the side of Damwon. But the plant has quickly and swiftly gone down here for the side of Boom Esports. Really taking a blitzkrieg onto that A site and now the retake will have to come on in. For the most part, they're kind of situated here on this heaven position, trying to push out of the rafters. And little do they know, maybe under them, there are two players here from Boom on these hell positions. Now, intro on the push. Philip Jitter will actually find the opening pick as Texture was the only one to drop on down. Eugene finding a double, but he will be taken. Dom, we're going to have some idea of what's going on over on Catwalk. Yeah, Philip with the cards, with the hand that you're dealt right now with. 
Now they're trying to take your talents towards the speed side. Lots of defenders already here waiting. Texture in that smoke could potentially give them if they're not ready for his push. Intro on that back side, able to find one. A double for him. Eugene doing the same. And now it closed the door. You can actually put pretty low trip wires there to catch her out. And with the nerf, she doesn't break those anymore. Jung Hai getting the kill initially on the site. We're going in fast. Jong Hai, okay. Secret trying to follow up on that 4v3 already. They have control of the tree position here still, as they have not been able to really kind of overrun that boom for the meantime. Getting caught out here on that A main position, but the defuse is trying to be stuck as the divide does expire. That will actually give them some space to try and go back and dip into it, but the uh -oh. pull is perfect here. Secret finding one, though. He's holding down the line. Asterisk, he's going to have to th spray through the smoke as the time is going to be ticking, and the defuse clears those corners. He's checking it. Oh, he spotted him out too. Flip Jitter will actually get the kill with a Spectre up close and personal. Those weapons can certainly steal a kill every now and then, and that he does. But Texture will answer back as well here, coming from down one. So 4v4, but the time is ticking, running away now from Boom as Eeyore able to snipe Texture there. Good kill from him, and another kill from Flip Jitter on that flank. Great rotate hold by him, and Secret will get the trade. 2v3 right now, but two players from the side of Boom are quite low. A single bullet will do him on him. Oh, man. Flip Jitter finding a third. What is his positioning from him can he find the fourth he's done his job he's held the rotate they could not go and help too early the plan should go down secret will find him but the damage has been done it's a 1v2 here ender and it's all on a secret and blaze has the time he comes around the corner secret's gonna get shot in the back on 4 but you can see there's not just a tripwire that just got destroyed also a camera from intro and three players of dom one trying to hold this but it doesn't even matter flip shooter gets the kill frostmine takes down texture and all of a sudden boom have blown up the round once again intro the only player to hold down the fort in mid okay so with that opening now it's like Okay, what do they do here exactly? Position, make sure nobody's too close. But Frostmind is waiting here right in the pocket, and he will find that shot. Boosted up. That's a third for him in this round. It's all in the Jong Hai. Gonna say hello and actually get that. Isles from Catwalk peaking top mid going to be the plan for them. But I think Flipster actually just saw the Cypher. They're going to blast out onto the site. Oh man, but Jong Hee on the swing. A double for him. They're stuck in place from the gravity well. And Asterisk will finally shut him on down. Getting a double of her own here, at least for the side of Boom, as Eeyore chimes on in. It's a 3v3. The judge can be very deadly. It is an eco here coming from the side of Damwon, but look at his positioning from Eeyore. Finding a second kill, not expecting him to be there on the off angle up top of the heaven. And now going down to hell, Eugene will send him to that place. Asterisk coming on down. It's now a 2v2. Now Blaze is inside the smoke. Will he get caught off guard? Able to actually back off for the meantime Woo! but that one make the thrifty happen and they cut the to go hold a but the spike is still outside b main over in tiles and they're surely running out of time on that endeavor as well. Secret will get a kill, which is huge now for Damwon, but a same kind of uh, emphasis put on that coming from Frostmind to bring it to a 4v4. Typically favors the attacking side in this situation, but Secret will equalize things up and give them that lead even here on the ER. Intro doing the same exact thing. He's potentially going to find a second. No, Flip Jitter holding down the line, but a quick trade here coming from Jong Hai. It's all on a Frostmind. Now he might be ice cold. His brain might be on point, but can he be able to land the shots to make this? happen they know that he's here towards hell to try and stick this plant flash on now he's done dead and dealt with as and really let, letting it bake in the oven here and so will he continue on that flip jitter pushing all the way day and down frostmine and secret both of the skies were either side finding a pick a piece and both jets also going down so that's a bit of a coincidence for you guys eeyore on Ooh. the peak but intro is gonna show him the way on out and it's a quick 4v3 here already it's a Pretty much a scramble, honestly, happening here for both teams. Blaze can definitely be a one round for them. Again, though, the retake utility is so difficult to work against here for Boom. So even in a two versus three, it is not going to be easy. You got recon bolt, no flashes left. up at the moment for Secret. So that is a bit of relief for Boom. But you can see Secret finds Blaze King, gets another kill. Dom Juan didn't quite work out for them, so. You rely on individual play can sometimes oh. be difficult and texture puts that individual jet dip on the board right there and a second one to boot 
completely making a huge difference here. Ender not able to land the follow-up shots, but he's gotten two and gets the third with a classic free gun, by the way. But up close, just can so slow right now. And the spike is is rotating back over towards the A site. They're trying to convince Dalmuan that it could be a hit on either site. But as the time continues to tick away, the spike is going to the site where there isn't your sky. Like right now, you're going to be walking in just dry onto this A site, and you have to clear intro playing back over towards generator he sees a gun he gets the kill yeah that's a very wayward wall there for either side and intro finds a double from that generator just completely creating the energy here for the side of damwon to get back into the round not that they ever lost it frostmine he's been over there and sky being the lurk was not the right call this time around boom just sending everyone through a tree room but intro is stuck in a main again so we could blow this one up once again Secret on the site, it will get completely oh. cleaned up here. Eugene from the tree just planting them down solid. And now it's all in a frost mine. He might be a sky, but he can't heal himself on up. 1v2, they know he's in the generators. Pulled on here, he has to go for the plant, but no, he can let it go. He's got some time to work with. But he's got a dash. He can make that happen once again for the team. And yep, that's the same jet play you've seen a million times here. And DK are on the site. He gets that opening pick on the Eeyore, and that was a huge pick to find, especially this one on the Asterisk, who was one of their only hopes on map number one. John Hai will secure the kill on the Blaze. Another big player here from the side to Boom Esports. It's down to a quick doobie for immediately just completely rushing over the site. There, there wasn't anything it seemed like Boom Esports could do to really stop that endeavor now. Flip Jitter, he knows there's one here towards B main secret, has got his mark and his number out of it. It's a bit too much there that he can really deal with. His gravity wells will cause a bit of a problem, not too much actually, as now that is a great stun here coming from that uh, trailblazer on secret. Oh. He finds a double just somehow on the flank here, popping out of the smoke, and he pops two heads here on the side of Damwon. So, okay, he's caught the screen player, and he gets him as well there on that door. Flip Jitter opening things up, just a deep, deep dot. Think about this Astro smoke here, especially dodging away the dart, is he can flash straight out of this, go for the peak himself. Doesn't even take the peak, instead playing a little bit slower with players on back site, but Dom on absolutely raging through the site. Okay, Guardian in the hands here. Wild shots here coming from Frostmind and cannot connect. As now it's all on the Eeyore in a 1v5. A few players are quite low, but that's not on back. Was there for a moment. You might want to place it on B. Eeyore gets a couple of big kills here. It's a good start to the round. That's not something they were gonna want to re uh, I guess reapply here, or I'd rather have a reset of. Now, intro making his way in towards that site. There is a player here in the back of the site on Eeyore, but the perfect flash is going to give him away as well. Quickly traded now by intro. And Asterisk finding a double intro, a third, but Asterisk will find his own. Okay, well, that has been given away. And Eeyore, they line up for him. A double kill and Flipjit has a perfect position as well here to punish intro pushing through this and secret. And that shall be given away. Flipjit, a double for him as well. It's actually going to come into A, but the Hawk from the defending Sky Frostmine, I think is going to sell this one. They know it's going to be an A hit. He has his Hunter's Fury as well of his own to really use here. And Frostmine, he's been caught on out. Perfect flash by him. He's going to blind a bunch of them. A texture will still get that kill on a Frostmine. Asterisk waiting inside his own smoke. This could be huge for them. But Woo! here comes Flip Jitter. A one kill from him. Secret finding a double, though, to hold down that line. They still maintain supremacy of the site here. On the peak, Eeyore will get that oh! kill. He dissipates the double from him, keeping them alive. No sleepy eyes. And it's a 1v1. He does not know where he is detained. The knife to come on. On in and they win. Side Ender, there's a lot in store. Most of our players on the map are here, and Asterisk will dip in a bit too deep as Sexter punishes him. Eero will find one secret, and John High find another one. It's a quick, thrifty round looking like so far here for the side of Dam Juan. Blaze King has been known as that neural theft will come online. So 4v2. With relative ease. You can see there that based on their positioning, they were kind of expecting something a bit slower as Intro is able to find Blaze. Like, you saw Asterisk waiting inside the site, not expecting that to just come his way full send. And, oh, he actually spawned tournament point. Has been gotten here, taken by Damwon. Alrighty here. Whew. Although as Eeyore crawls in there, that might change very soon here inside the market. Given away as well, perfect. You're gonna try and flood it out once again, but it seems like Boom are a lot more prepped to try and retake this than the last round was.
Yeah, I mean, they've got the, the lockdown ready coming on through. You have to use that Hunter's Fury. That's what Eugene does there to make sure they can destroy that and stay playing on this site. 4v5 on the retake. Eugene gets two, though. It's huge for Dom Juan here. They're all trying to filter themselves here on top of the heavens, and they shall be sent to hell as Gong Hai will get the potentially last kill of his own here. Flip Jitter 1v4, tournament point, and